magicians out there, all of you need to watch as closely as you can to this effect because this is going to fool each and every single one of you out there. And I can say that with confidence because this is not my effect. This is something by Christian Grace and it's the most fooled that I've ever been with a card effect. Ooh, exciting. Welcome to Fool Everyone. This is my wife Kaylee. Hi. There's a bit of added pressure here today because this is the very first time I've performed this trick so it could go wrong but ultimately I hope it goes right because I want to do Christian proud and I want you all to see just how powerful and deceptive this effect is and I'm telling you the truth this is the most fool I've ever been with a piece of card magic. This makes me excited you saying that. Yeah I'm nervous but it's kind of excited so here we excited. go. <laughs> Let's go. Kaylee, you're going to follow my instructions really carefully. Okay. In a minute, you're going to cut the deck any way you like. So you can cut a small pile, a big pile, whatever. Okay. Cut anyway. Yeah. Look at the card you cut to. Yeah. Remember it. Say it to yourself a couple of times in your mind. Okay. And then shuffle it in. Okay. To the pile. Place that pile down the table. Pick up the other pile. Shuffle that. Tell me when you're finished. Okay. I'm going to look away the entire time. All right. And no, the deck is not marked. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Cut we anyway. Go. Okay. Remember that card? Yep. Shuffle it. Oh, I'm scared. Right? My shuffling skills are not the greatest, as you can see. Alright. Fair so far then? Yeah, way fair. Alright. Yeah, okay. Put it down the table. Okay. Pick up the other pack. Yeah. Shuffle it. Okay, here we go. Oop. So, if there was any card I could have peeked on in the top of the other pack, that's now been destroyed. Yeah, that was my method. Got it. Tell me when you finished shuffling. <laughs> yeah, I finished. Good? Yeah. Oh, shuffle them back together. Shuffle them both together. Oh. Okay, just in case there was any way of some. <laughs> well, all of my methods have just completely been blown out of the water. Good? Yep. Then. Yep. Happy. Yeah. Oh Think about this from a point of view. You cut anyway, you shuffled it, mm -hmm. you shuffled the other half, you shuffled it all together. My back was turned the entire time. Yeah. The cards are not marked in any way. No. And we haven't set this up in advance. No. I'm going to say something to you in a minute. Think about your suit in your mind. Okay. Imagine screaming it to me mentally, but don't give anything away. Okay. I'm going to say something to you right now. Don't give anything away. Spades. Diamonds, hearts, clubs. Oh my gosh, that was so intense. <laughs> <laughs> kind of wanted to laugh all the way through as well. Though. No, look, I'm not going to say your card out loud, but I think it was a pretty high-ish card, like a jack or something, right? Mm -hmm. Hold your hand out. Oh. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm so excited. I'm committed. This isn't going to change. That's it. Your decision has been made. Okay. Think about this, everyone. If this deck was marked or in some sort of stack, I could have looked at this card or somehow... That was my next card. But they were picked up, both shuffled, with my back mm. turned, shuffled together, and you told me nothing about your card. What? Please be right. <laughs> I was right. <laughs> Kaylee. Yeah? For the first time... Yeah. Name your card out loud. The Ten of Diamonds. <laughs> oh no. Alright, okay. Oh no. Show everyone the Ten of Diamonds. Oh my god. Yeah. How does that work? It's literally insane. It's literally insane. That's impossible. Yeah, I know. I That's know. impossible. That is impossible. I <laughs> How could you have said, how? How good is that? Oh my God. How good is that? I mean, just from, I mean, how do you, how do you come back? For, how do you, I mean, I don't how know. How do you even start trying to work that out? Yeah. Because when you start during the trick, every single hurdle you get to, you think, oh, that's how it's done. Oh yeah. no, wait. Oh no, that's how it's done. Oh, oh no, no, wait. Yeah. Oh my god, that's so, the reason, so good. I'll explain to you guys why this is so fooling. I can't teach it to you because it's not Christian, but I will tell you where you can learn it. Um, it's so fooling because at the beginning, 
you see me yeah. do a really bad shuffle, means nothing because in a minute, with my back turned, you cut and remember a card. Yeah. Now, in other ways, you would try to achieve this, you would peek what this card is. Yeah. But my back's turned. And I could have tried to peek this card, the card that you picked as well, but this is shuffled, right? So yeah. that destroys anything here, and they're not yeah. marked. The method should be here, but then you shuffle these, and you destroy everything here. Yeah. And then... You got put them together. You shuffle them together and destroy everything here. Oh. And you tell me nothing. But I don't... I was going to say that. There is no way of you peeking. There is no way of you having it in a certain... At a certain position so you know where it is. Mm -hmm. You don't know what card I picked. Yeah. I don't say anything out loud. The only thing you ask me is the suit. And I... Don't even give I didn't, you a verbal I didn't answer. Ask, I didn't ask you the suit. You just say all of the suits. You don't even... Yeah. You don't ask me a specific I just try to read suit. the body language. Oh, my days. I'm going to reveal this to Kaylee. I'm so excited. And you're all going to see her reaction. Okay. This is my trick to teach. You can learn this on Christine Grace's Magic Monthly. Link is up here and up here or down below. Um, but you're going to see what she thinks of it from a practicality and impressive standpoint. So... Here we go. <laughs> bang on. And that's the method. Oh God. It's pretty damn simple. I think I could do that. I think you could do that. I kind of just did. Yeah, yeah, you <laughs> literally just did. Whoa. But... What a, what a That's crazy... so innovative. Yeah, it's so innovative, isn't it? So you wouldn't even... I wouldn't have even thought of how to do that. No. You wouldn't guess. You couldn't guess. No, you can't. That's so... It's very clever. Christian, that is clever. <laughs> it is. All of this stuff is very, very clever. So good. He's brilliant. I so... love that. <laughs> brilliant. Isn't it? Isn't so it? So fooling. <laughs> My gosh. It's one of these tricks that I, I wish... I could never have created it. It's too smart for me, but I wish Good. I did. Mm. Even though I didn't, I'm going to perform this on every <laughs> damn magician that I see um, because it's just not just every magician, every everyone I see. It's brilliant. It's really, really clever. <coughs> and knowing the method, it's even better. Isn't it, it blows. It blows your mind as a trick. Knowing the method, I was like, oh my gosh, I wanted to have a go. <laughs> <laughs> And I don't, obviously, can't even shuffle a deck, let alone do tricks, so that was so good. It's, uh, honestly, one of the best card tricks I've seen. Yeah. And I don't, I don't rate card tricks sometimes because they are so done and so overused and each, there's thousands of different methods of doing it, but that method. It's legit. Literally. <laughs> mind blown emoji. <laughs> Send. <laughs> So, guys, this is called uh, Divide and Divine by Christian Grace. And you can actually all... And this sounds like such a pitch, but I'm just, I'm, I just love this effect so much. It's so good. Um, there's a link on screen here uh, and in the description to Christian Grace's Magic Monthly. Uh, and it's on there as part of like another 31 other tricks, which are all just in literally incredible. If they're anything like that, they must be incredible. Uh, there's one on there called the Knowing Principle, which I'll perform to you maybe next week. Okay. Which... <sighs> it's, it's disgusting. <laughs> it's so gross how good it is. But this thing was, is sort of like, I've always loved the effect of having somebody think of a card and just shuffle it into the deck. That, the, is, the that is kind of the ultimate, though. You want someone to know your card without knowing anything. That's it. It doesn't get any better than that. Um, so yeah, everyone, if, go, and, go and sign up to Christine Grace's Magic Monthly. Use the link here or in the, in the description below in the video. Uh, I'm going to learn this now. It's, it's like, I, I am actually for the first time on this show. I am actually speechless. Like there's, I have good, no words. It? It's a card trick, but it is like the ultimate card trick, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. If it, yeah, a pick a card for a pick a card, find a card effect. Pff, try to do better than that. It's blown everything out of the water in my eyes. That was <laughs> a brilliant trick. I love it. <laughs> Insane. <laughs> All well right. done, Christian Grace. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video and you like learning about fooling pieces of card magic, why they're fooling and how to learn them and where to learn them, then hit like on this video and as always, please hit that subscribe button. 
<laughs> and if any of you out there want to win my double disc DVD set called Odyssey, uh, it's got about 20 super visual, super practical pieces of magic on there, then all you need to do is hit that subscribe button and comment down below, pick me, and I'll pick one of you at random to win this sent you free anywhere in the world. But I love that piece of magic. Amazing. Thank you all for tuning in. Come back on Sunday for the live Sunday session. And as always, tune back in for the big one every week, Tutorial Tuesday. You know the place to find it. Thank you all so much. I'll see you all very, very soon.